Hey everyone, today we're gonna do something different. And if you get that reference, you'll know I went to college in the early 90s. Check it out. All right, welcome everyone. My name is Chris and this is my channel, North Garden Comics. Like I said, today we're gonna do something different. I'm actually shooting an impromptu video to participate in a contest being put on by fellow YouTube creator, The Comic Collector. Now besides the fact that you could win some really cool comics if you win the contest, I really liked the purpose behind the contest, which is to drive awareness and support for different channels in the comic book, pop culture, and entertainment community. So to participate, first you had to subscribe to Tim's channel, the host of the contest, done. Then he gave shout outs to five channels that he wants to see grow in subscriptions and he posted links to those in his description of his video. And you had to go to those and you had to subscribe to them as well. Rule number two, check. Now the third rule we're fulfilling right now, you have to shoot a video and give shout outs to at least three other channels that you'd like to see grow in subscriptions. And I've actually chosen four because these are just channels that I have benefited from. I'm still a young YouTube creator, but I've just enjoyed the connections that I've made with these guys. I like their content. And if you like content like this, I would encourage you to follow the links that I'll post in the description below and subscribe to them as well. So that being said, here are my shout outs in no particular order for the channels that I would like to um, mention as part of this contest. First, uh, Mike W. Rogers. He has 223 subscribers. He is a screenwriter and a comic book lover, and I've enjoyed the connections with him just over the, the hauls that he's brought in. He and I shared a, a similar mystery box that we each bought from Mile High Comics, and it was just fun to see what he got, what I got. So that's, that's channel number one, so please check him out and subscribe to him. Channel number two, Library of Comics. He is at 230 subscribers. Library of Comics, I think, may have been the first channel that I subscribed to. I love his content. He is a run collector, which I can completely relate to. Love filling out runs. And he will show you the different runs of a lot of the different titles that he's collected. Not to mention the fact that he has some amazing short box art and has done a video, thankfully, showing us all how he did that. So. Thanks for doing that and uh, check his channel out and subscribe to him as well. Number three, channel called Magic Lasso. He's sitting at 210 subscribers and Magic is one of those folks where he seems to be on a lot of the same live chats with me and he always gives a shout out and a hello. So love that connection, love that reaching out. Uh, he's got a good Wonder Woman collection, past and present. He's got some great comics, a lot from the Bronze Age. So check him out as well and see what he has to offer and subscribe to him. And then fourthly is a channel called Bearded Comic Bro. I mean, you almost don't need to say more than that, but Bearded Comic Bro is at 82 subscribers right now, and he's like triple threat. He's got a great beard that puts mine to shame. He loves good craft beers, which I do as well, and he loves comic books. So I, I don't know what else I need to say. That's like enough said moment, but please check him out and subscribe to him as well. Those are my four sh shout outs. Once again, Mike W. Rogers, uh, Library of Comics, Magic Lasso, and Bearded Comic Bro. There are links to all four of those channels in the description below, as well as to the host of this contest, uh, the comic collector, Tim. All those down below, please check them out. And if you love comics and reading comics, uh, I think you'll enjoy the content that they have to offer. Now, before I leave you, I feel like I should show you something comic book directly related and not just make this be a submission for a contest. So I actually will show you the two comics that I posted on Instagram today. These are not likely to be speculator books. These are not likely to be hot books anytime soon. I don't think you're going to see TV shows or movies or anything about these coming soon. But I posted these today because I've been collecting comics since the late 80s, early 90s. And for me as a teenager at the time, and I'm sure it was just part of the momentum at the time as well, so it's not completely my fault, but at least some part my fault, but I could not resist a number one. And you'll believe me when I say that, when I show you these books that I bought, and I bought it because it was a number one, here we have number one in a four issue limited series, the protectors of the environment, they are brute force. <laughs> now, most of you have probably never even heard of this, which is no surprise, but you know, 
really, I mean, a cybernetic dolphin, I mean, why wouldn't that take off? Um, but this was a four issue limited series. I only bought two of the issues. That's number one. And then here's number two. This is the, the nemesis team, the evil team that is there to fight the brute force and they're called heavy metal. Heavy metal is here. Oh, so, um, yeah, that just goes to show you that not every number one becomes a key collectible comic. So that's going to do it for me. That's going to do it for my entry into this contest. And that's going to do it for showing you a cool <laughs> number one and number two from 1990. As always, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time.